Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and this is going to be a love reading for the sign of Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Oh my god, wow. Overall energy, Ten of Cups. You could be dealing with a water sign or you Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio or you could have water in your birth chart. This is what you're looking for, this is what you want or this is what you already have or this is what you're going to get. This is a happy family, this is... This is a happy married family. This is kids. This is happiness. You want something that is going to make you emotionally very, very happy. There could be a water sign around you who makes you very, very happy. All right. First of all, card. So the first card we have is we have the five. The Eight of Pentacles. Uh, this is Earth Energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, this is you being very, very focused on your work or being very, very focused on a relationship all right you want to put in the effort into a relationship or you're putting a lot of effort in your career in any project okay but this is putting an effort okay you want to invest your time into something we have the judgment this is a reconciliation there could be a past person that you're looking at maybe that you've been gone through you've gone through a breakup maybe there's a separation maybe you guys aren't talking whatever it is right this is a reconciliation this is giving something a ch another chance this is rebirth all right this is getting second chances we have the eight of cups in reverse this is more water energy this is you not being able to move on from something, okay? This is you being stuck. You're not being able to move forward from something. You don't want to move on. Either you're not moving on or they're not moving on. It could be both of you. We have the Queen of Swords. This is air energy. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. You could be having this in your birth chart or, or you could be dealing with one. This is someone who is uh, who is ready to cut out the bullshit, okay? So this time probably when the communication happens or if the communication has already happened, someone has given a very... Um, a very direct this is very direct communication you know like no rosy uh, no rose colored glasses anymore no um, uh, sugary talks nothing at all no bullshit okay this is what it is and i only want the truth that's all she cares okay so if you're coming towards this person with any kind of bullshit i don't think you should try okay or this person if you're going to approach any person also and if there's someone something that you want to put in your investment in all right please see to it that this person is not fucking around okay they're not fooling around they mean business more cards for capricorn and love for the second half of december please one card flew out just one second Okay, we have the nine of swords that flew out. I'm not going to pick that up, but someone could be having nightmares. Someone's having sleepless nights, stressing over something. More signs for the, more messages for the sign of Capricorn and love. Second half of December, please. Whoa. Okay, again, something fell out. One second. I don't know why the gods are falling out. We have the Six of Swords in reverse, not taking it, but yeah, someone's not being able to move on. They're not going anywhere. More messages for the sign of Capricorn and love, please. More messages for the sign of Capricorn and love. Wow. More messages for Capricorn and love. Second half of December, 2019. Okay. King of Cups. You could be dealing with a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or you could have water in your birth chart. This is someone who is emotionally stable, all right? This is someone who has their head and heart in place. Um, you could be dealing with someone who is emotionally mature, or there could be an age difference between you and this person, okay? This, some, this is someone who is very emotionally mature, okay? They will think and act. They have a lot of emotions for you. You love them. They love you. Okay. <clears throat> We have the Two of Pentacles. This is Earth Energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is you trying to balance a situation or you trying to balance two people or two situations, okay? This is you trying to gain clarity, all right? Maybe you took a time off. Maybe you started working on yourself or maybe after gaining clarity, you have a clarity but what you're making choices, okay? This could be choices between two things or two people, all right? Maybe now you're gaining clarity. You need to make a choice and you're ready to invest into something, all right? 
maybe you were even very focused on your work okay and now you're gaining clarity about what you want whatever you want right the decision that you're going to make it's going to make you emotionally very very happy i'm assuming you have the nine of cups more what energy the reconciliation is going to make you very very happy either this is your wish that has come true or this is their wish that has come true okay it could be mutual you both could be wishing for the same reconciliation but yeah it's coming we have the ace of pentacles in reverse this is earth energy someone is still doubting if this is going to happen okay that is why they're in two minds so someone doesn't know if they should walk away or they should still be there okay that's why there is a delay in this new beginning someone is still doubting if they should start restart something new or uh restart something new no that's not start something new or restart an old relationship okay so the, the, this is that doubt this is that delay only because someone is still stuck okay they don't know what they need to do they don't know if they should walk away or they should still be there okay however we have the five of pentacles in reverse under the queen of swords this is more earth energy this is someone who is letting go of the past this is someone who is trying to probably when they're talking to their friends and taking help from their friends or this is just someone who wants to come out of the cold or you want to come out of the cold and you want this reconciliation all right, you want this reconciliation and you have probably uh, made a decision or you're still trying to gain clarity or you already have clarity about what you want and whatever you're going to do, it's going to make you emotionally very, very, very happy. It's a wish come true and that's why you're ready to invest and ready, you're ready to be focused on this relationship. All right, Capricorn, thank you so much for watching this video. Please like, share, subscribe, leave your comments below. I'd love to hear them and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.